Today I have an absolutely simple but crazy delicious vegan soup recipe for you, loosely based on the traditional Greek rice lapa. I'm just dolling it up a little bit with some veggies, but when you look at these ingredients as a whole, crazy, crazy good. And in terms of level of skill, if you can boil water, you can make this. So first things first, I'm going to start off with four cups of water. I'm going to be doing one cup of long grain rice. Now, here's the thing. For this, you can use basmati rice, you can use jasmine rice, you can use whatever rice you want. It is totally up to you. There is no sauteing or simmering in this. It is very, very straightforward. You put everything into a pot and you just simmer it until the rice is done. So the next thing, I'm going to take one onion real quick and I'm just going to chop it up as finely as I can. All right, so my onions are done. Even if you get a few bigger pieces in there, it's not a big deal. These will go in there. The next thing to go in is my carrot. Now here's the thing with carrots that I'm into lately. I really don't peel my carrots. I find they're, uh, if you just wash them, they're totally fine as well. And I want a little substance in this, so I'm just gonna slice my carrot. Even if I get a few bigger slices, not a big deal. The next thing to go in here is I've got some corn and I'm going to put about half a cup of corn in here. I want to have a little consistency. I like the, the chew and the texture that corn gives as well. I'm going to do another half cup of peas and it's really going to, again, add such a nice flavor to this. I'm going to do some seasoning and you can go fairly generous on the seasoning with a little bit of salt and pepper. The next thing, of course, I'm gonna do about a quarter cup of my Greek extra virgin olive oil. And now, I'm also gonna take the juice and the zest of one lemon. Perfect, that's good right there. Now, here's the deal. When this thing comes to a boil, I'm going to add my rice, reduce heat and simmer it until the rice is completely cooked through and we're done. My soup is ready to go. It's been about 20 minutes. Full disclosure, I did have to add some, a little extra water. So keep that in mind, depending on the rice you use and how it, uh, how the water evaporates or gets absorbed, you may have to kind of adjust your water, but that is totally fine. It is a thick soup. It is hearty, even though it is vegan. It is, that means nothing in this case because you have full of flavor. So basically maximum flavor, minimum effort. Now, the lemon. I'm gonna take my soup here. I'm going to add my lemon at this stage of the game because I don't want uh, to, I didn't want any of that lemon flavor to get cooked out. So I'm just gonna very simply just Take my lemon here, try and catch the pits if you can. And that's it, my friends. That is it for my vegan vegetable rice soup. All done in one pot, ready in about 20 minutes. And the flavor is gonna be absolutely tremendous. The original version of this is what's known as lapa in Greece. And it's very simply boiled rice, a soup with just boiled rice. And at the very end, they squeeze a little bit of lemon in it. And that's usually for like stomach ailments and all that. And who am I to argue with like little old ladies dressed in black that swear by this? It's insane. Look at this thick, hearty, really delicious. The zest cooked into the soup. The lemon at the very end was absolutely uh, the, the kicker that brings the soup over the top. Mm. Mm. 
so good and so simple. You could even serve this as a sort of gazpacho as well. Uh, serve this chilled will totally work as well. So that's it for this episode on my very easy one pot rice soup. Veggies, vegan, not complicated at all. Very easy to make and ready in well under half an hour. I thank you so much for watching for this recipe and many others. Check me out online as well at kensgreektable.com. And until next time, please take care of yourselves and each other. Stay safe and I will see you on the next one. Much love. Bye for now.